Hola, Gemini Sun, Gemini Moons. Welcome to your 2025 Sun Moon reading. If it resonates, consider a personal pre recorded or live reading. Just click on the link tree below to contact me or text me at 646 902 5715. When you see this, is when you're meant to view it. It doesn't matter the time of year. Also, check out your 2024 Sun Moon readings in my playlist. See if they rang true for you or someone you know. I have changed the format this year. The first portion of this reading, I will go over the traits of your Sun Moon combination, pull the main cards for the first half of the year and take a quick look. The second portion is in the Vimeo link below where I will have the second half of the year in addition to clarifiers for all cards and a card of the device. Fi oh, I was like, finally, but I'll mention that later. So Gemini Sun, Gemini Moons, when you envision something, you see the path very clearly and then work to get there. You're known for your knack to make friends because you are so authentic and open. That sense of humor, penchant for fun and storytelling doesn't seem to hurt either. You're a kind person, but also stand firmly in your truth and ethics. Highly intelligent and quite the conversationalist, you will seek peers out to engage with, to exchange information and innovative ideas. In love, you can be a playboy, playgirl, or play person, but you definitely like to play. In fact, role playing is one of your many talents. Just don't get lost in any one personality and make sure your lover knows who they are in a relationship with. Then again, there is a part of you who will want to nurture relationship and commit. It's a mixed bag in love with a double twin. In whatever field of science or research you land in, you're very good at your job. Even though you you, you seem those around you like, what? Oh, even though <laughs> those around you flit around on the surface, you're actually very thorough. Oh, okay, I'm sorry, my notes. I mean, these are, I, I handwrite this stuff. Um, and I, sometimes I write it, my handwriting, I'm like, what? Even though you seem like you flit around the you flit around to those on the surface you're actually very thorough and take your work very seriously okay so i hope you understand that that other people when they look at you they they think you might be a very surface person but like when you settle on something you really kind of dig in and get it done so in fact you're very capable in a quick moving machine and can problem solve while it's operating so let's see what we have holy spirit angels divine god's universe can you please write your truth your wisdom your clarity and your insight for Gemini Sun, Gemini Moons for the year 2025. What do you see? What do they need to know to reach your heart? Ground become closer to universe and closer to divine. What do you see for January and February for Gemini Sun, Gemini Moons? We have the Nine of Wands in reverse. Also, check me out on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. Like, share, subscribe, donate, refer a friend, and support my efforts. That's always greatly appreciated. March and April, we have the Nine of Cups in the reverse. Alrighty, and for May and June, we have the Page of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, um, January and February, I'm getting the sense that you're being very open. I actually feel like you should be a little more guarded than you're being. I feel as though anybody that comes along, you'll talk to them. You're not questioning motives. You're not, you're just taking people at face value. That really doesn't surprise me because you all are very friendly, very amicable, very trusting people. So, you know, anybody that comes towards you, you're just gonna, like I said, take them at face value. Not really, not really, you know, get suspicious or anything like that. Um, or I feel like you actually Actually should be suspicious because the card that follows it with the nine of cups in reverse is known as the dum 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 notoriously as the narcissist card so somebody's coming in in March and April who um, is an egoist is superficial is puts their priorities first <coughs> excuse me and sidelines your priorities so it's all about them, what they want, how they want it, and things of that nature. Um, yes, they can do crazy stuff too, like gaslighting, love bombing. This doesn't have to be a romantic love interest. This is just somebody who has these narcissistic tendencies who are coming in. And I feel like they did get in because you, you are so trusting and you do give people chances. Um, but I when we get into May and June, I see this situation worsening because now you're really starting to see how materialistic this person is, how they're all about money, how they're not very good with money, how they, um, I feel like they're taking from you and, or they're doing things to you and they feel they're deserved, de deservedly doing so, or they're entitled to do so because they're very haughty. They're very arrogant. It's sort of like they're doing things and then 
but but they feel like they they're allowed to do them it's almost either an attitude of oh gemini gemini sun gemini moon isn't going to do anything about it if i do this or what are they going to do or oh they weren't going to use it anyway so i'll just take it you know i i mean i just get that kind of attitude where I feel like somebody is really trying to take advantage of you during the first half of 2025. So, um, you know, these readings are meant for you to look at them and then just kind of say, hey, you know, it's this, this is kind of happening. What can I do to avoid that? And you can really kind of nip it in the bud um, in January and February if you just look at people a little bit closer and examine them. I'm not saying to be paranoid or anything like that, but, you know, just don't leave the door wide open for everyone is the sense that I'm getting. But we'll, we'll see in the Vimeos. So um, if this did resonate, consider a personal pre-recorded live reading. Just click on the link tree below to text me. I mean, to contact me or text me at 646-902-5715. Um, but make sure you click on the Vimeo portion of this reading. I'll pull the second half of this in addition to clarifiers for all of them and a card of advice for 2025. Check out your 2024 sun, moon readings still in my playlist. See if they rank true for you or someone you know. And then finally, look me up on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, like, share, subscribe, donate, refer me to a friend and support of my channel. Always greatly appreciated. Otherwise, Gemini, Sun, Gemini, Moons, I will see you in your video reading next. Adios for Veronica Garnett. Bye.